Illinois HVAC license. Starting an HVAC business in Illinois is very easy, but before making your steps in that field, you have to obtain an Illinois HVAC license. There are different types of licenses in Illinois. EPA certifications. People who work with refrigerants must obtain this kind of certification. This has different levels of certification. Firstly, Type I is for servicing small appliances. Secondly, Type II is for servicing or disposing of high to very high pressure appliances. Thirdly, Type II is for servicing low pressure appliances. Fourthly, Universal is covering all three types. All the applicants have to pass the EPA's core section. The section will cover knowledge on the following topics. Depletion. The Clean Air Act and the Montreal Protocol. Ozone. Section 608 Regulations. EPA certification will never expire. Nate License Certification. This certification is more comprehensive than EPA certification. There are four different types of Nate License Certification in Illinois. Ready to Work Certificate. HVAC Support Technician. Core and Specialty Test. Senior Level Efficiency Analyst. ASHRAE Certifications. Certified HVAC Designer is one of the most popular in Illinois. This designation displays your ability to size equipment properly, to perform load calculations, to create the piping design. Considering the fact that the state does not have designations for apprentices, journeymen, or master HVAC technicians, the earnings vary. Entry-level technicians earn approximately $32,460 per year. But the most highly experienced technicians earn about $84,990. The costs of licensure vary in different states. It will be better if you check with your school or organization administering the exam to learn the specific cost. Note that some HVAC schools include the cost of an initial test and the tuition. For the initial test, EPA 608 basic certification requires $24,95. And for each additional attempt, you have to pay $5,95.